Hi, thanks for stopping by. Today I've got a full body dumbbell workout for you, a little bit heavier on the arms. Uh, here at Benefit Fitness, we do corporate wellness programming as well as this YouTube channel where we do 30 minute workouts, 10 minute workouts, and some nutritional tips and tricks. So why don't you go grab yourself a set of dumbbells and we will jump right in. We're gonna just start with a slow jog. Just bringing those knees up. We'll just do our normal squats, the lunges, all the good things. Keep it moving. Go right into squats in five. And three, two, one, and squat. Legs wide down, up. Pattern yourself, proper pattern. Sit to those heels, push the floor apart. Every time you stand up, we're pushing apart, pushing apart. Down and swim. Like that. Come on. I know. Five more. One, two, three, four, and five. Reverse lunges. Step back with the right. Let your knee rest. Side bend. Good. And then step back with the left. Side bend to your right. Squeeze the glute of that back leg, sending that hip forward. Really trying to, like we're trying to push that hip straight forward. Not arch your back, your hip is going forward. Two more. Lunge, one, lunge, two. We'll do our inchworms. Hinge down, nice hinge, reach your butt back. Feet are flat on the ground, legs are straight, walk out to plank position, hips down. Shoulders away from your ears. Good, press back up, walk it in. Try to keep those legs as straight as you can. Only walk in as far as you can, still getting that good stretch in your hamstrings. So, so if it's only like so, into downward dog position, that's great. And right back out. One more after this, and we'll finish with our scorpion. And all the way down. Hips down, chest up. Plank position, and then control your movement down into the ground. Hands under your chin, bend your left knee to 90, reach it for the sky, rotate towards your right elbow, tuck those ribs down. Really stretching through that hip of the bent leg and the chest and the shoulder of the arm that it's going towards. Good, and back one more each side and we'll get started. And then the other way. All right, let's get on up. We're gonna have four exercises today, 30 seconds on, 10 seconds rest, three times through. We're gonna start with a sumo squat. So you can hold the weights however you feel comfortable. I'm gonna probably hold them out here. So toes slightly splayed out. Please don't go so, so far. Tightly splayed out, make your knees go over your second and third toes, elbows inside your knees, press up. Good and controlled. Pushing the floor apart, squeezing your inner thighs together. That's number one. Number two, we're gonna do a shoulder press to a tap back. So you're gonna press overhead, tap your toe back. Press and tap. Exercise two, exercise three. I'm just gonna hold one weight. We're gonna do a single leg squat. We're gonna take your foot forward, I'll come to the side. We're gonna sit back. And stand, 15 seconds on one leg, 15 seconds on the other leg. Final exercise, pick up both weights. We're gonna do a V raise. We're working a little bit more shoulders and squats first round. Okay, let's do it. 30 seconds, starting with those sumo squats. All right, we have all ladies with us today. Let's do this. All right, hold them up. In front here or here, if you want, you can drop them in down in front of your uh, legs right in front. So push the floor apart, squeeze those hips forward. Or you can, I'm gonna hold mine up here, or you can push into here. Down and up, good pace, it's only 30 seconds. So challenge yourself, finding your pace. When you do it, make sure we're pushing the floor apart so your hips are slightly coming forward when you come stand. Hips towards the screen, down and up. Keep it going, five seconds. Three, two, one. Arms up by your shoulders. Remember, we're gonna tap back, alternating legs, pushing towards the ceiling. Punch the ceiling every time. Ready, and punch. Tap, squeeze the glute, driving your heel back towards the wall behind you. I'm getting them coming sideways, so you can see as I push. Push, push. Come on, down and up. Rotate those weights so they are Lined up with one another overhead. We're punching the ceiling. Come on, go. Eight seconds. Whew. And five. Push it out. 
three, those shoulders should be burning. Woo. All right, single leg squats. You can hold no weight, you can hold one weight, you can hold two weights. I'm gonna hold one weight. I'm gonna sit into my back leg. That heel is on the ground. Sit back as far as you can. Good, keep that heel on the ground. Sit, stand, 15 seconds, sit. Stand, big chest. Good, drive through that heel, hip forward. All right, switch legs. Sit back to stand. Come on, knock it out. Don't let that knee jump inwards. Think about pushing. Feel like your squat, you're kind of pushing that floor apart, making sure your knee is in the same direction as your second and your third toe. All right, V raises. Lead with the thumbs. So you're coming up into a V position, not quite out to the side. These might be a little heavy for me for 30, well, it's only 30 seconds. Focus. These are slightly heavy for me, so I'm gonna slow it down. Go in control. If you have lighter weights, knock out the reps. Good, keep your shoulders away from your ears. Raise and lower. Tall posture. Breathe. 10 seconds. Woo, these shoulders are gonna be burning by the end of this round. Five. How you doing back there, Brad? Nice and quiet. <laughs> doing great. All right, you guys, sumos. So wider stance than, you nor than your normal squat, toes slightly splayed out, not all the way out like so. Make sure your knees are going over your second and your third toes. Good, nice and low, push that floor apart, hips forward. Down and up. Find your pace with your weight. Keep your shoulders down your back, away from your ears. Come on, knock it out, down and up. You only have 15 seconds. It's only 30 seconds. Feel that burn. As you get tired, keep pushing through the burn, good form. Good, five, two, one. All right, Woo. my shoulders are ready for these. Up at your shoulders, remember we're punching the ceiling, we're tapping our foot back. Ready, and tap, tap, good. Focus on your weight, just being in that planted leg, that back leg, just tapping. Find that rhythm. Woo. Looks good, Amy. Nice job, Sky. Reach it and tap. Tap. Turn you sideways. So you can see, push. Make sure your uh, weights are stacked right over your head. Do not let them to be stacked in front of your head. Directly ahead. Punch the ceiling. You got it, Brad. All right, single leg. You can hold one weight. You can hold no weight. You can hold two weights. I'm gonna sit back. It's only 15 seconds. I'm gonna try my two. Sit down to a stand. That front leg, or I'm sorry, the back leg is doing all the work. The front leg is just a little bit of a kickstand. Only 15 seconds here. Come on, sit down. Stand, shoulders away from your ears. Don't get, don't get tense. Stay loose in the upper body. Okay, switch legs. Switch it down and up. Sit in to the back leg. Good, big chest. Five seconds. You're long and lean when you stand. Even when you sit, don't let everything crouch forward. All right, V raises. Ooh, these are gonna burn for 30 seconds. Lead with the thumbs. We're going at making a V with our body, not straight out to the side. Thumbs, lead the way. Ooh, I gotta go slow, this is heavy. Good. Keep your glutes squeezed. Your ribs are tucked down. We don't wanna make sure, as it gets heavy, I would have a tendency to wanna swing like so to get there. I'm not gonna get there, you gotta stay strict and strong. No swinging. Woo. Five seconds, knock it out. All right, nice job. One more round, you guys. Two more squats. Get into that position. Remember, like so, we come up and check on peeps. Oh, with us today. Nice. Let's go, let's go. Down and up. Awesome, ladies. Come on, keep it going. Got a class full of ladies working hard. Good, push that floor apart as you stand up. Knees kind of spread up out. Good, squeezing the glutes forward. Pinch, it's like you're cinching up those inner thighs. Cinch them up, three, two, come on, knock it out. You can do a few more. All right, shoulders. Ooh, I'm just swinging it out because my shoulders are already feeling it. Tap it back. Try not to use momentum from your lower body to push up. We're just tapping, staying stable and tapping. 
Come on, it's only 30 seconds. If your weights are light, you can reach and press so much. Big chest, down and up. Make sure your biceps are in line with your ears. The weights are stacked right over your head, not in front of you. Breathe, tap. Whoops, I'm tapping wrong. Tap back as you reach up. Tap back as you reach up. Yes, all right, single leg. Use both weights, no weights, or one weight. Okay, remember this front leg is just helping support. It's not getting much of your weight. Sorry, your toe is up. Good, sit back. Sit into your heel of the back leg. Good, come on. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Switch legs, last 15 of this exercise. Down and up. Good. Stay through it. Eight seconds. Sit as low as you can. Push away. Sit as low as you can, even if you have to go slow down. Sit. All right, good. Final shoulder raise. Pick up those weights. All right, ready? And up. Control. You have heavy weights, nice and controlled. Make a V with those arms. Try not to go all the way to your ears like this. We're gonna get into our traps. I'm gonna just focus on shoulders right now. Shoulders away from your ears, thumbs to your shoulders. Right back down, 15 seconds. Woo! Burn, burn those arms. Let's go everybody, come on, keep pushing. Keep it going, that burn is what counts. You have five seconds. Come on, give me a few more, Brad. You've got it, Sky. All right, nice job, you guys. We have another round of four. Pay attention. If you need to grab water, you can. I'm going to show you our next movements. So we're going to go back to our squats. We're going to do normal squats with a pulse. So again, you can hold them into a goblet style. You can hold them up at your shoulders or down by your side. Okay, so we're going to squat. We're going to do five pulses. One, two, three, four. On the fifth one, stand. Okay, squat with five pulses. That's number one. Number two is going to be a rear fly to a, a T. So we're going to leave with our pinkies. We're going to fly back behind us. Palms together. Now we're going to go shoulder height. Pinkies behind us. So we're really working the back of our shoulders, pinching through our shoulder blades. Exercise two. Exercise three. Reverse lunge. We're going to split halfway. So we're going to split squat. You're just going to go down, curl, right back up. Down, hold it, curl, right back up. Switch 30 seconds. Final one. We're going to do our plank position, a little core and shoulders. We're going to walk forward. Extended plank, walk back. So it's a plank walk out. Walk forward, extended, and back. Got it, guys? Ooh, let's do this. 30 seconds each movement, starting with your squats. Grab those weights here, here, or here. Whatever feels comfortable on those shoulders. Actively push it. If you're holding it here, push it together. All right, get ready in five. We're gonna stay as low as you can in that pulse for five. Ready? And down, pulse for one. Get low. Two, three, four, and stand. One, two, three, four, fifth one, stand. Sorry, Brad, I'm kind of doing it wrong. Two, three, four, fifth one, stand. I guess it's four and then stand. One, get low. Two, low elbows between those knees. And stand. Good. Get low. Come on, brace your core. Control that pulse. You're not just bouncing up and down. Stand. So I want to make sure you're not just kind of Bounce in, get low and controlled. All right, so now you're gonna hinge over with a flat back. Notice my back is flat, my butt is back. I'm gonna leave my pinkies behind me. So see, they come behind me like so, and then I'm moving a T. Pinkies behind, now a T. Leave pinkies behind, and T. Good, the low rear fly to a T. Control it, if you feel like you start Losing it in your low back. Draw on that torso, stay strong. 10 seconds. Ooh, we got it. Almost there. Three, squeeze your booty, pinch those shoulder blades. Good. All right, everybody get into your split squat position, kind of like a reverse lunge. I'll come sideways so you can see. You're dropping down to 90, take that knee off the ground. Then you're gonna curl, stand up, drop down. Curl, stand up. Drop down, curl. So we curl in the bottom, slight lean forward. Good, one more and switch. Switch legs, down, curl, stand up, drop right back down, load up that front leg. Squeeze the tush. 
Good, you guys, come on. All right. Down in your plank position. Working our core, working our shoulder stability. Right down, come on, let me see. We can see. Okay, walk forward, extended, walk back with the right. Then switch left, forward, left, back. Right, forward, right, back. Keep those hips super still. Widen your legs if you need, widen those legs. Nice job, you guys. Breathe through it. This is all about control, not about speed, because when you're in that extended position, it's a little bit harder on your core. Bring it right back under. Almost there. Yes, back up. Okay, so our squat's one, two, three, four, and then up is five. Sorry, I probably wasn't very clear with that. Okay, down for one, stay low. Two, three, four, stand. Go down. Two, three, stand. Good. One, sit low, push that floor apart. Four, stand. One, two, three, four, stand. One, two, three, four, stand. Come on, five seconds. One, two, three, four, and stand. Yes, T's and low flies. So palms face your thighs when you hinge first, lead with the pinkies. Pinkies lead the way. Then palms face one another, palms lead the way. I'm sorry, back to your hands. Pinkies lead the way, palms together, back of hands lead the way. Pinkies, back of hands. Pinkies, hands. Good, 13 seconds. Pinch those shoulder blades together. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Try not to get tense in your neck. Our neck wants to do a lot of the work. Three seconds. Woo! All right, split squat and curl. Okay, get into that lunge position. Get low. I sometimes rest my knee first so I can find my right position. Knee off the ground, curl, stand, down, curl, stand, down, curl, stand, down, curl, stand, down, let's go. One more. Switch it out, quickly, quickly, drop it down. Curl, stand, curl, stand, drop it down. Load up that front leg, stand, drop it down. Good, get that knee as close to the ground as you can. All right, plank walks. Plank position. Widen those legs if you feel like your hips are moving too much. If you wanna make it more hard, put those legs together. If you wanna make it harder, good. Switch it every time. Control, keep the shoulders away from your ears. Don't shrug your shoulders as your arms reach forward. Good. Woo! Breathe through it. Squeeze your quads. Drive your heels towards the back wall. Good work, you guys. Three, two, one. All right, one more round. One more round. Hold your weights however you feel comfortable. Get ready. And down for one, two, three, four. Stand it up. One, control. Two, three, four. Stand it up. One, two, three. Stand. Oh, my fault. I can't even count right. One, two, three, four. And stand. One, two, three. Four and stand, good, five seconds, get low for last one. Two, three, four and stand. Good work you guys. Remember pinkies to hands. Hinge over, nice flat back. Get ready, hinge back, leave the pinkies, palms. Pinkies, backs of your hands. Good, fly it back, keep your shoulders away from your ears. Nice tall posture, think about your head and your butt are being pulled in opposite directions. You're long and lean in that hinge position. Five seconds. Two, last one. Good, split squat position. All right, let that knee rest first if you need, so you get set up. Take that knee an inch off the ground, curl, weight over in that front leg. 
Notice I'm not pressing back to a straight leg, so that's me pushing back. I still want my weight over my front leg. Curl, stand, still hinged over. Good, give me one more. Switch legs. Curl, stand, down, curl, stand, down, curl. Load up your front leg, down, curl, stand, down. Come on, you can do it. Woo. All right, plank it. Stand in your plank position. All about control here. Don't let those hips move from side to side. Okay, walk forward and back. Nice control, this is not speed work right now. Stay in that extended position. Squeeze your quad, drive your heels towards the back wall. Nice and controlled. Alternating arms every time. Right, right, left, left. Keep it going. Good, you guys, come on. Four, three, two, one. All right, nice job, you guys. Grab a sip of water, wipe your sweat off. You got some. We have four more movements. Good. Do you want to set her up there, maybe? All right, you guys, last four. Again, you're going to grab your weights halfway. We'll switch. We're going to do a lateral, do a lateral squat or lateral lunge, then a transverse. You're going to come at 45 degrees, sit back, straight up. Lateral, feet together, transverse. That's exercise one. We'll switch at 15 seconds. Exercise two, we're going to do a push up to a climber. We're gonna come into our push-up position. Push up, knee in. Right back out, push up, opposite knee in. Back out. That's exercise two, exercise three. You're gonna hold the glute bridge position. We're gonna do triceps. Bending those elbows so your elbows always point to the ceiling. Drive straight up. Final exercise. We're gonna do an up-down plank. We're going back to our plank position. Now we're just gonna press up, straight up. With the right, down with the right. Up with the left, down with the left. Okay, all about control. Yep. All right, let's do this. Grab those weights up by your shoulders. Hi, baby girl. You're gonna watch mommy work out, okay? Lateral lunge, center. Now you go 45 degrees, turn. Good, center, lateral lunge. Sit those hips back. Center, turn it to 45. Put your weights wherever you feel comfortable. Make sure your knee is always, no matter what direction you go, your knee is going over your second and your third toe. Switch sides, other direction. Lateral, turn 45 degrees, sit back. Lateral, turn 45 degrees, sit back. Keep it, all right, good work. Push up to climb. So you're gonna do one push up, you're gonna draw your right knee into your chest, push up, left knee into your chest. Okay, ready? Push up, knee in, pause. Right back out. Push up, knee in, pause. If you need to come to your knees in between, come into your knees. Up to plank position, knee in. Come back to your knees. Plank position, knee in. Come on, 15 seconds. Woo! Good. We can do it. Awesome. Chest down. Press up, knee in, hold. Get going, you've got it. We're really burning these arms this last few exercise. Glute bridge, triceps. You're okay, little one. All right, you guys. Drive those hips up, bend those elbows. This, uh, weights come right by the sides of your ears. Press through, keep those hips lifted the whole time. Driving through those heels, shoulders are away from your ears. Good, let's go, let's go. Come on, stay focused on your movement. Focus on breathing. Don't arch your back in that glute bridge position. Keep your ribs tucked down, work those arms. Good, good. Two, one. All right, roll back over onto your plank position. Up, down planks, you're welcome to do these on your knees if your arms are already burned out, or you can go all the way. So, straight arm plank position, down to forearm plank position with the right, back up with the right, now go down with the left, and then up with the left. So switching every time. Right, right to press up, left to go down, left to press up. Keep those hips super still. If you need to come to your knees, come to your knees, nice and controlled. Make sure that arm is right underneath your shoulder. You wanna make sure you're not in front of you here. We've already done some of those walkouts. Okay, keep going, right. And press up with the right and left. Woo. Two more rounds, those were great. All right, so we're doing our laterals. Weights here, they're in front of you like this. Push them together, 
We're gonna lateral lunge to the side, sit that hip back, come to a balance, then lateral, for, turn 45 degrees, sit that hip back. That other leg is straight, back center, so lateral lunge. And then we're gonna turn 45, keep that front leg straight, sit back, switch sides, other leg, lateral. Turn 45, sit back into that heel. Good, lateral, sit back to 45, sit into your heels. Good work, you guys. All right, push-ups to climb. All right, plank position. Think about when you're pushing up, you're, you're trying to screw those hands into the ground. It's gonna help get more strength into that push-up. Okay, push up. As you press up, screw those hands into the ground. Knee in, down. Screw those hands to the ground as you push up. Knee in and down. Come on, you can do it. That screwing of your hands is gonna help give you a little bit more strength in your chest. As we're pushing through the floor, we're screwing in. Good. Almost there, five seconds. Whew. All right, on your back. Glute bridge, triceps. All right. So, drive for your heels, your hips are up, your ribs are tucked down, arms are straight over your head. When those elbows bend, the dumbbells come on the outsides of your ears, press straight through. Don't let those elbows flare out. Don't let them move to the back as you do it. Keep them, your arms straight up and down. Good. Keep your core solid like you're gonna get sucker punched. <sighs> Breathe. That's it, you guys. Seven seconds. Give me a few more, knock them out. If your weights aren't too heavy, you can move faster. If they're too heavy, move slower and controlled. All right, down to your plank position. Up, down planks. All right, remember, shoulders over wrists the whole time when you press up. So, and then now here are my elbows, my shoulders are over my elbows. When I press up, my hands come underneath my shoulders, so I press up through there. Okay, let's focus. Alternating arms, every time. I'm not always leading with the right, because then just that right side will get really strong, the left side won't do much work. Come on, keep it going. Good control, hips are still, quads are on. Woo, all right, one more round and we're done. Pick those weights up. All right, laterals to transverse lunges. Lateral lunge. Turn 45 degrees, 45 degrees, good. Or we can call them a 45 degree lunge. Turn them to 45. Good, sit back, sit, sit, sit as low as you can. Press back up, turn, sit as low as you can. Okay, switch sides, switch sides. Lateral, turn 45, sit back. Keep that leg straight, lateral, sit back, 45. Good, three seconds. Whew. All right, set those dumbbells to the side for your push-ups. Again, remember, if you're looking at the screen, think about corkscrewing those hands, screwing those hands into the ground as you press up. It's just you're thinking about that tension. It's gonna help you get a little bit more strength into your push-up. Knee in as you press up. <sighs> Hips are level. Down, lead with the chest. Make sure your neck doesn't drop down to the ground. Pull your neck back if the chest reaches towards the ground. Come on, keep going. Focus. As you get tired, slow it down. Focus on your form. Drive in. Good. Give me another one. Whew. All right, on your back. Get on that back. Let's do those triceps. Hips stay lifted the whole time. Good. If you want to add a challenge for this last round, take one foot off the ground. Tell you to switch halfway. Come on, drive. Keep those hips still. Gonna focus on your triceps, focus on level hips. Driving through that heel, switch legs. If you're doing one leg, you don't have to. I just wanted to add an extra challenge for this last set. Good. Come on, you can do it. Almost there, we only have one more exercise left after this. Push, elbows towards the ceiling, dumbbells towards the ceiling. Final one, up, down planks. Get to your plank position. Come on, you can do this, it's only 30 seconds. Stay really focused and intentional. Get ready and drop it down and back up. Remember your hands come right under your shoulders, then your elbows come right under your shoulders. Back and forth, keep those hips still. Focus on your positioning of your arms. Keep it going, 14 seconds. 
Woo, burn, burn. Come on, keep it up, you guys. Quads are engaged, core is strong. Two, one. Woo, nice job, you guys. Happy Monday. That was great, you guys. Thanks for joining us. So good to see you. Sorry, Brad, I had to step away. This girl doesn't give us a half an hour to work out. That's okay. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you guys for coming. Thanks for working out alongside of us today. I know I'm gonna need a nice stretch in this upper body. Hopefully you'll take some time to do the same. Remember to subscribe to our channel. Also leave feedback. We love to hear from you as well as to provide new fresh stuff to you. So remember to stay tuned. We'll see you next time.